effective concentration. We're going to need 10 test tubes, two 10 milliliter graduated cylinders, two 250 milliliter beakers, and one 100 milliliter beaker. I ha I've already obtained some of solution A and solution B. We'll start with filling up our test tubes. We're filling up our test tubes first before we put the reagents together to do the reaction. In each of the te five test tubes for solution A, I'm going to put 10 milliliters. The concentration of solution B is going to be what's changing. In each of these test tubes, I'm going to place a different amount of solution B and then top it off up to 10 milliliters with deionized water. Starting with test tube one. Get your stopwatch ready and start it as soon as I pour these two into the beaker. And stop. Test tube two. Test tube three. Test tube four. Test tube five. 